yourself if you compare to yourself you can definitely find your goal you mm. uh, you can accomplish your goal right mm. so always compare to yourself like what were you before and where have you is now right yeah. so compare now you are visiting the audible bot so first we will introduce each other after that we will start our conversation i am tanya and i am joining you from jaipur rajasthan that's all about me okay that's very wonderful okay ma'am so i'm going to introduce myself so as you know my name is babita i'm talking to you from gorakhpur about my education i have done graduation with english i did pg i did ba and also qualified ct and upt apart from that i'm a homemaker simultaneously i'm running youtube channel if i talk about, about my hobbies i love singing yoga and nowadays i'm very fond of talking with the people because of my communication skills along mm -hmm. with i'm a pro kids that's all mm -hmm. about me thank you okay in this video we will do a activity i will narrate a story and after that you will tell me the teachings of uh, that story okay okay what uh, what we, what do we have to do In I will narrate a story for you. After that, you will tell me the teachings from that story. Teachings, moral teachings. Okay. Okay. What did you learn from that story? Okay. You can elaborate anything from that story. Mm -hmm. Any incident after that, you can share. Okay. Okay. So in this story, there are two characters. They are the sister-in-laws. Elder one name was Neha, and younger one name was Mira. Neha was well educated and she was working in a corporate. She was getting a handsome salary also. On the other hand, Meera was a homemaker. She was not so much educated, but she has a, a special talent. She was very good in making pickles and papers. Everybody always praised um, Meera for her. Um, sorry, Neha for her for her income. Sometimes Meera feel okay. I am not so good. Just like. Uh, uh, my sister in law one day she was just making pickles and poppers then her children <clears throat> randomly record her video and upload it on instagram fortunately it was it went viral everyone was praising uh, meera's work she is very good in pickles so they were sending dms can you make these homemade pickles for us then we will give you money then she was confused how can i start my business from home then his hus her husband and children encouraged her you can set up her uh, your business in a, your kitchen then she again encouraged and she started uh, her business after that she uh, she earned so much amount then neha understand like if we are working in a corporate and if we are working in a good office so we should never under underestimate any one's quality okay that's okay. you understand we should never under uh, estimate any one's quality because god has given everyone some special quality we should always respect their work no work is small and no work is very significant every work has uh, same um, respect yeah right ma'am yeah so from this story you know uh, i got like uh, first thing is that we should always respect our work and we should do our work with happily right and we should uh, encourage to someone if they are very good at this work right because her husband or and her child uh, were supporting them right supporting her right and that is the reason he got like he has he has uh, he had got like uh, praise and appreciation a lot of people right and also uh, she was earning money right so i think uh, we should always praise our work and we should do our work with happiness because mm. happiness is a really very uh, very good thing right so if you do your work with happily and if you are very interested in your work so sooner or later you will definitely success in your life but right? you know in the society there is a uh, i can say scenario like if you are working outside as a teacher as a in a office they are giving you more respect than a, a homemaker who are also doing uh, work household chores but they are not giving respect yeah right ma'am because they are going outside and that is the reason the people have thing people people have this kind of thought 
yeah she is going outside and after coming at home uh, she is also doing uh, household chores as well right and she is getting a lot of money and mm. uh, she has she must have a lot of knowledge as well about technology about others opinion because she is meeting uh, a lot of people right mm. they have this kind of opinion right but i think we should not compare to anyone mm. always compare to ourselves if you compare to yourself you can definitely find your goal you mm. accom- uh, you can accomplish your goal right mm. so always compare to yourself like what were you before and where have you reached now right yeah. so compare only to ourselves it is better but if you are going to compare to other people uh, like we will not uh, be uh, like move ahead in our life we will not yeah. right because uh, it kind of like negative clutters we are collecting in our head right mm. always compare to yourself whatever you are doing you are doing well job right and do your work love to yourself right and respect to yourself and sooner or later you will definitely get good results in it mm. and sometimes you know like people have stereotype perception like this job is very good job and like if you have started your own business at a small setup they are just thinking okay like you are doing this kind of thing they are not giving so much respect to that work why mm. you are earning also but they are not giving respect yeah yeah because they have a negative clutter also in their mind in their head like uh, yeah this good, uh, this work is not good right and that good uh, that work is very good for me they are always comparing that is the reason i think and i think we should start from early age like our child is very in a small young age then we should you know teach our child no yeah. work is very small and no work is very significant yes definitely if you are thinking like every work is very essential in your life right and if you are doing that work with your passion with your dedication right so definitely you can accomplish yes if you are very passionate regarding your hobbies regarding your work then you can get success in every field yeah in order to achieve anything first thing is that you must have interest in that mm. work in your field whatever you want to become whatever you want to do in your life then only you can move ahead easily and effortlessly then mm. no like nowadays it's a social media era we can you know like if we are very good in acting singing dancing then we can post our video on instagram right ma'am yeah definitely because nowadays it is very easy to do sitting at home right if you have yes. little bit time for yourself you will definitely uh, make time for yourself and you can make any kind of videos whatever you like Ac- according to your congenial time you can make videos and you can just post so you know uh, it will take time so you must have patience in it and uh, like with time you can get mm. you can achieve- Yes. Yeah, every. Like there are so many channels. Like there is one famous YouTuber and uh, influencer also. Uh, she is uh, Bristi. Yes, I think you know Bristi. Bristi Kitchen and Kavitaaj Kitchen. They all are you know handling cooking channel. Yes, right, ma'am. Yeah, and yes. getting very very good results, and also they are getting a lot of subscribers as well yeah. day by day. right yes. yeah because they and, had this sense in their past mm. right and they are they were doing like uh, with patiently with determination every day they were posting their videos right and that is the reason now they are very comfortable in it and they are uh, getting a lot of praise as well from other people they are consistent and they are getting million views million views right yes mm. and you know they have started their business from their kitchen kitchen right so yeah always we think like in a positive way everything whatever you have knowledge just start from zero right so uh, if you are uh, going to start anything from zero so with time and in your future definitely it will become very big mm, yes but you know like it's a human tendency if we are not getting sometime views sometime like we are not uh, achieving subscriber also we feel right. demotivated yeah and that time we feel monotonous in our life yeah this work is not good for me i am not getting a positive results and people are not liking my videos like this we have mm. a lot of yeah this kind of thought 
So we should have some patience. Yeah, we should have some patience and uh, yeah, because you know uh, we should always focus on our journey, right? Mm. It is uh, like beta. Like uh, if you are not getting good uh, like uh, views and uh, like earning money, if you are not getting like. But one thing is better for you. You are learning something new every day from yes. other people, right? Yes. You are mm. not wasting time. You are not ruining your time. You are learning every day. You are exploring your uh, uh, like. Uh, like i can say mind as well right mm. yes so i think it was a wonderful session with you i hope you also enjoyed this story yes ma'am i enjoyed a lot with you and thank you so much for giving me this kind of activity because i didn't never uh, do at it right this kind of activity so thank you so much yeah thank you giving me your precious time